Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you all have a lovely Thanksgiving next week. And in preparation for the holidays, we are gonna learn how to create a coloring book inside of good old Book Bolt. However, depending on the niche that you target, you can sell coloring books all year round if you want. And they're not super hard to create either. It might seem intimidating. No, you do not have to draw the images yourself. They may be pre-made images. You might be taking a color image and changing it. There are lots of different things that you can do to create coloring books. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you exactly how you can create your very own coloring book interior right inside of the new Book Bolt Design Studio. There are also a few tools that make it a ton easier and I'm going to be sharing exactly how you can do it, a couple of different ways that you can do it, and my hope is that this inspires you to create some coloring books because it's also super fun. I do want to mention Book Bolt actually has a premium plan that includes a lot of different things, but one of the main things related to coloring books is that every month you will get four different sets of coloring book images, all the same theme, and they look super cute and professional, and it's really easy to plug them inside Book Bolt. Just the regular Book Bolt plan is great if you're starting out, but if you're ready to go super professional or just want all those fancy features, because there are many of them, then make sure to hop down and click the link in the description to get started with the premium plan of Book Bolt. Or just get started with Book Bolt in general if you're not already familiar with it. It's an excellent software that gives you design, keyword research, all sorts of different tools that will totally change your KDP business book better. Now, without further ado, let's go create that coloring book. Hey everyone. All right, first off, really quickly, I wanna talk a little bit more about Book Bolt Premium because it is really, really cool, all the different features that you'll get. And I just wanted to go over them because I couldn't fully remember them while I was talking to you guys. But now that I'm at my laptop, it's a little bit easier. Here are all the things that come with Premium. Obviously all the same stuff that you'd get with a regular account, but you'll also get 12 week private training seminar, four premium monthly sets of graphics. So these are for your coloring pages. They look awesome. I'm gonna show you in a second what they look like. All right, and then we get 10 monthly premium ready to upload book interiors. So as you guys probably know, BookBot already has a bunch of interiors that you can use, but you'll get 10 extra ones each month, which is absolutely awesome. And one of the coolest parts, you get a monthly niche report. That's one of the hardest things with creating low content books is just knowing what niches to do and the fact that you will have your very own monthly niche report including keywords for just a bunch of different niches that are popular it is honestly awesome it really just keeps going to show that book Bolt is just such a great all-in-one platform because here i was promoting easy pub profits because i thought easy pub profits was awesome but book Bolt has that as well in a sense so you really just get everything with book Bolt and top it all off premium support you get support above what what the regular plans get. So altogether, quite a nice deal. It is 30 bucks a month, so it is pricier than the other version, of course, but there's still the three day free trial. You can still use my coupon code, Sarah20, to get 20% off your first month. And remember, 30 bucks a month can turn into this. Remember, it's an investment. I just wanted to share that with you guys because I just recently learned that BookBolt had premium and I upgraded and it is amazing. Hands down, would recommend. Book Bolt just always blows me away. <laughs> so anyway, that's enough about Book Bolt Premium. We are now going to go ahead and start working on our coloring book. I'm really excited to show you guys. I've already started working on it, but I'll show you exactly what I did to get to that point. Here is my beautiful dinosaur coloring book for toddlers. This is actually, I'm not the best at creating covers for coloring books and activity books, just because it's such a completely different design from notebooks. So this is actually something I took from Creative Fabrica and edited a little. I kind of messed with the text and I'm going to change up the back here and add the interior some examples of it in a little bit so I'll show you guys that but of course you could always create your very own from scratch I just decided to keep it simple I just edited it a little bit now we're good to go okay but when you first get in you are going to want to hop over to click create a new project cover and interior project name whatever you want to call it trim size I did 8.5 by 11 I think that this is best it's the best size it's most typical for coloring books, activity books, you name it. Black, white, and tear with white paper. Bleed, I always do 
bleed page count this just comes down to how many coloring pages that you want in your book mine is around 40 you can always add or remove later just keep in mind that that will change the cover of your book just the size of it also if you want to keep a page separate so if you've got 20 coloring pages that would be closer to 40 pages i don't think it's right at 40 pages it might be 38 not 100 but again you can easily add and remove just to make it work so here is what i've got pulled up with all my lovely pages here are the four sets of graphics these are what you'll get for your first month and then it'll change throughout so we've got dinos fairies flowers and friends and the ones i wanted to use are dinos they are super super cute just looking at these i think they are adorable they will look excellent in a coloring book and i am going to add them into my coloring book granted you could also totally take coloring pages from creative fabrica create your own i'll show you some ways to create your own in just a little bit creative fabrica has a ton i just wanted to show you guys just typing in dinosaur coloring pages the results are basically endless there are also activity books all sorts of different things so if you need help with coloring books you can always come to creative fabrica as well and honestly there's just so much here that is so different and unique so you really don't have to worry about accidentally having your book being identical to someone and you can always edit it yourself just to make it a little bit more unique. I just, I've never known that being a problem. I know some people have issues with stuff like this. It just comes down to what you personally feel comfortable with. But anyway, Creative Fabrica, tons and tons of designs. Basically, just what we have to do is add in these designs right into the interior. And to do that, we're going to pop over to the file library and then stick all these guys right inside. All right, here they all are. We'll go ahead and get started started first off one thing i want to do really quickly is start by creating a this book belongs to page because those are always an excellent way to start off a book and they really just go that extra mile all right so i'm gonna have it say this dinosaur coloring book belongs to but now i'm just going to kind of mess with it so it looks a little bit better change the font and all that jazz i actually just recently uploaded one that i think is super cute cave stone so fun and it works really well for the theme all right and i kind of changed the font for this and belongs to and i've got dinosaur coloring book really standing out here i think it looks adorable now i just need to throw in a line thicken it up maybe i'll throw in a second i'm also going to throw in these dinosaur footprints as well just for the heck of it because i think they're really cute and boom we are done with our this book belongs to Paige and I think it's super fun. So I think I'm going to shrink my little feet. There we go. All right. Now what I'm going to start doing is adding the dinosaur images to all the pages. So popping back over to the file library, we'll just go ahead and get started with the first one and then continue down. Clicking on it, it pops right up here. I don't have to change it or anything. It is the perfect size. And because it's bleed, this works just fabulously. And as you'll see, I left a space in here just to make sure that everything is separate and i'll just continue doing that throughout the book and one thing else that i want to note that's really fun is i like how it says on pages so if you just have a bunch of images and maybe you're kind of spacing out differently you're choosing this one and then this one and then this one you don't have to try and guess which ones are already on the pages because sometimes it's easy to forget because it already says here that it's on the page if it says preview that means it's not within your book it's really just a subtle thing but it simplifies the whole process and there is our last dino picture and as you can see we just have one page left to spare so we'll just right click and delete it but what's going to remind you that it's going to change the page count and it'll affect certain things but that is just fine we'll just make sure everything looks good after removing that all right so now that means we have 39 pages here they all are they look lovely super cute and we've got our book belongs to page now let's check on our cover here all right it looks like it is just fine so basically our whole book is done that took just a few minutes super quick and easy to do i'm just gonna do one last thing because i think you should always do this with coloring books especially activity books as well is adding examples of what the images look like to either the front or the back both if you want and the way that i'm going to do that is come to elements grab a rectangle make it white twist it around and just make it smaller less tall and there we go now i'm just going to take that and then i just added it here throughout the rest of the back 
that cover. So we've got our little example pages. Now we just have to fill them. So we're gonna pop back over to the file library and just grab a couple pictures here. Maybe this one, this one's really cute. And we are just going to have them populate these pages. It might look a little wonky from here, but if we zoom in, it is just fine. Now I'll just keep grabbing a few others and keep going throughout the rest of those pages. And there we go, here are our example pages on the back of the book. Looks super cute. I chose a few that I feel like are some of the best ones to really get a buyer to consider purchasing this book. And that is it. We are essentially done. That was so easy. Now all we have to do is come up here and download our project in CMYK. While it's working on downloading, I just wanted to show you something else that I created while I was preparing for this video, just to make sure that I had everything down pat. I created this super cute dinosaur scissor skills activity book for kids. I chose this because one, it was easy. This is something I pulled from Creative Fabrica. I just edited it a little. I added it here into the lovely interior. I created this book belongs to page. Looks a lot like the other one. Really cute, really simple. And I want to mention I did a little bit of research and I found that this is a great niche to go after. I'm excited to get this book published. But I'll just show you here is what it looks like. It's really cute. Just some scissor skills. This is just another example of the lovely things that you can create in book bold really easily. And again, I pulled this from Creative Fabrica. You can find stuff anywhere. I think book bold and Creative Fabrica are going to be your best sources. Now I want to show you guys really quick how you could create your own coloring pages if you don't want to pull them from other places. You're going to come back over to your file library. Essentially, you're just going to grab any sort of graphic. All right, let's say we are looking for a picture of a dolphin. For one, I do want to note that there are some that you could already use, like this one right here is essentially already kind of a coloring page. So you can easily grab some that already work as coloring pages. But if not, you can just find a graphic that is colored in. You got to look for a specific type. So for example, I feel like this one would stand a good chance at working. So to make this into a coloring page, one of the first things that we could do is come up to effects, click black and white, and there we go. There we have a coloring page. It's not the best coloring page, but it shows you just how easy you could create a coloring page. And another way you could do this instead of black and white is we can come up to outline image. This doesn't work for everything. You'll want to play around with it, but let's see what it does. All right, here's what it came up with, which honestly is is not super bad for coloring page though this is a lot of black but just showing you that there are a few different options that you have there are other ways as well you could create coloring pages if you want to be super creative you can head into adobe illustrator or something but these are just simple ways you could totally make it more complex if you want but there are a few ways inside of book that you could very easily do this and one last thing i want to note so for my coloring book i've chosen the keyword dinosaur coloring book for toddlers because i have found that it has a nice search volume but the competition isn't super Super high. It is still a little higher than I'm looking for, but it's definitely a lot better than just dinosaur coloring book. So definitely make sure to come to Bookbolt to look through these keywords. And then once your book is finished downloading, all you have to do is hop over to your KDP account, choose to create a new paperback book. I'll go ahead and show you really quick because I have just filled out everything for this book. I've got my book title, dinosaur coloring book for toddlers, subtitle, I've got two keywords, and then I've got 8.5 by 11 with 39 pages because I always like to add that at the end. Author, prehistoric publishing, because I thought that sounded cute. Book details, I included the size, the book belongs to page, and then 20 fun coloring pages. I own the copyright. Keywords, I used a bunch of different keywords from Bookbolt. Bookbolt is an excellent source for keywords, both KDP Spy and just the keyword tool right inside of Bookbolt. And then the categories, I went with super simple, super relevant, animals, dinosaurs, and prehistoric creatures, and then activity books. Perfect. Low content book, I did not check this. I know my poo activity book, it was fine. So I'm sure this is just fine. I'm guessing planners is kind of the cutoff there. Obviously no adult content. And then of course 8.5 by 11, bleed and glossy because I think that's better for kids books. And I'll show you what it looks like in the previewer. All right. And here it is. It looks insanely cute. In the future, I might stick these pages up a little higher so that the ISBN isn't overlapping, but I think it still looks good. And here is the interior of my book. And voila, I whipped that up super quickly. And my price, I went with $5.99 because that seemed like the average within the niche. And I also upped Japan and Australia a little bit because they were kind of low on their side. And now I'm ready to publish my book. And that is how easy it is to create your very own coloring book right inside of Bookbold and get it published on KDP in mere minutes.
All right, everyone, thanks so, so much for watching this video. I really hope that it helped you, and I hope that now you can create lovely coloring books right inside of the book. It's super fun, and I hope that you enjoy the process. Remember, make sure to go and get started with Book Bolt's premium plan so that you can get all those fancy features, get all of those gorgeous coloring book interiors every single month, so that you can always be pumping out stunning coloring books that sell. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more content just like this. I would super duper appreciate it and I would love to have you. All right, guys, I hope you have a fabulous day and Thanksgiving next week. Bye.